after run the test and value is given by the machine you have to press no n for exit ready for analysis mode this is the menu button by using this button we can perform various functions in this machine let's have a look menu one for diagnostics one for daily cleaner two for maintenance three for sensor four for flow five for hardware six for reagent pack this is the reagent pack of this machine this this portion should be attached through this side and detach the backward pushing it backward number 6 reagent pack by pressing 6 i am going to show you the reagent pack info reagent pack id reagent pack info number 3 reagent pack consumption number 3 it showing that this is the reagent pack and solution left 55% that means 45% of solution reagent pack from this reagent pack is already used now in for exit total sample count number of sample it showing in for exit in for exit in for exit i can set the parameter 2 this is the number 4 parameters number 4 you can select the parameter from here number 1 sodium potassium if you want to run sodium potassium only you can select the number 1 by pressing this one and the machine gets ready if you want sodium potassium chloride then press 2 if there is electrode for ionized calcium is present then you can also analyze ionized calcium present in serum in for exit i am not selecting here because it is already selected in sodium potassium chloride mode in for exit number 1 diagnostics number 1 daily cleaner to maintain the proper functioning of this machine you have to run a daily cleaner regularly number 1 daily cleaner it's showing that please lift the sampler and insert cleaner this is the sample probe i'm going to insert the daily cleaner and it's showing that y for continue make sure that probe is in the fluid please remove the cleaner and close the sampler cleaning is performing you can see it's showing calibration slow after performing daily cleaning it gives you the calibration slow in for exit further in to exit and now this is the preface ready mode ready for analysis now i am going to off the machine as the test is run here the back side of this machine there is a switch just pressing the switch it's going to off